let's take a look at break-even analysis. So before we start, what does break-even mean? What does it mean to break even? So breaking even simply means making no profit or no loss. So that's the exact point where our sales minus our costs equals zero or our profit is zero. And breaking break even calculates how many units do we need to sell in order to achieve this zero profit. So why is this important? This gives us some measure of the risk involved in starting a new company, or if we look at our current sales, um, how, uh, how risky um, is it? So picture a bicycle a shop. We're going to start a new bicycle shop, and now we calculate our break-even, and we see that we have to sell 10,000 uh, bicycles. So there's a bicycle. 10,000 of these in order to break even. So what does this mean um, when we start? The, what will we do with this this ten thousand? So it's it's not just a number. We have to put this in perspective. So ten thousand bicycles means if there's thirty days in a month, if we even if we work over weekends, we need to sell more or less three hundred bicycles a day. So is this realistic? Where will we find buyers for these bikes? So you can see it gives us a measure of the risk involved if we know what the break even units are. Also, if we're currently making a loss. So say we're currently selling um, 500 bikes a month and we're making a loss, we would want to know how many more do we need to sell before we start making a profit. So we need to calculate the break-even point or the break-even units.